My father was a part-time semi-professional social and wedding photographer, so uh, you know, I, I used to follow him around when I was 10, 11, 12 years old and picked up what I could from him. It, very much it was a hobby till I was around uh, 30 years old. One Monday morning I woke up and really didn't want to go into work that day. As I was lying in bed trying to decide whether to get up or not, a saying from one of my favorite all-time books came into my mind. Every now and again you should ask yourself a question. Am I doing right now what it is I most want to do in the world? And if the answer to that question is no, then you should stop doing what you're doing and go and do something else. And so with that thought in my mind, I got up, I had a shower, put on my suit, went to the office and I resigned. From that day on, I've been a professional wildlife photographer. I'm completely at the mercy of the weather. I've used Fujifilm for several years now and weatherproofing in all of their cameras has been outstanding and the X-H1 takes it to another level. What brought me down to the Camargue originally was the horses. I fell in love with the landscape. It's very marshy, it's, it's very much governed here by the sea. The land is exceedingly flat, um, there are no mountains around. And, you know, there's some fantastic wildlife down here. It's the only part of Europe you find flamingos, for example. People often think that animals are unpredictable. The truth is they're not, far more predictable than human beings. Of course, the camera also has to be ready for it. Often I'm trying to handhold the camera in low light conditions. Image stabilization for me has always been a very positive thing. Now the reality is that I gave up working in a nine to five career to be a wildlife photographer because I didn't want to miss my moment in life. And the fact that the X-H1 has the image stabilization now in the camera just makes it even more effective. That basically means that I never missed a shot and never missed the moment.